All right, welcome back to the sports show on that damn YouTube. We're going back 1998. Going to check Minnesota Vikings going against the Green Bay Packers. Randy Moss lighting it up on Monday Night Football. Those Minnesota teams, man, absolutely stacked. Robert Smith, that running back. Obviously, Randy Moss, Chris Carter, Jake Reed was a hell of a wide receiver in his own right. Green Bay side, you obviously got Brett Favre. A lot of good players on this. So let's go ahead and check this out. This will be Randy Moss highlights mixed in between the game highlights. From 1998, Monday Night Football, Green Bay Packers against the Minnesota Vikings. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe. Let's do it. Second and 20, negating an 11-yard gain. Favre gets sacked, taken down by Derek Alexander, their number one draft choice in 96, Randall Cunningham. In his second season with Minnesota, took over when Brad Johnson was hurt. He's with him in the backfield. Robert Smith, over 1,000 yards last year. Charles Evans, the blocker. Reed and Carter outside. We'll see a lot of Moss as well. Glover, the tight end. Stussy McDaniel, Christie, Dixon, and Stringer. Very good interior five. Second down and ten, and Cunningham launches one, and there is Randy Moss. There's a flag down for the moment. It's a touchdown, but there's a penalty marker down to the 19-yard line. And this is coming back. Third down and 20 from the 15-yard line. And Randall's going to launch another one, and it is Moss who can't make the catch. Single covered by Darren Sharper. And there's another flag down up at the 38-yard line. This was a third and 20, and it's going to go against the Packers. Healthy before he comes back. Absolutely. Third and seven, and Leroy Horde is the tailback. They take it to him, and then the pass is caught by Carter, who is dragged down by Tyrone Williams. Of the Every time I think of Chris Carter, that's the exact image I have. It's just him stretching out for any ball that near his vicinity, man. He always had those plays where he's just stretching out as far as he could and put his hands out there and just snatching it out of the damn there. Is that Morton Anderson? Holy hell. Morton Anderson at this point has got to be about 50 damn years old. The National Football League. And this is a 33-yard attempt, and he is still perfect. 40-yard field goal attempt, Ryan Longwell, the ball spotted at the 30-yard line, and Longwell, in his second year out of Cal, bangs it through. Second and 10, early second quarter, the game tied, 3-3. Randall hangs in, throws, and it is caught! Reed spinning around, and avoiding the tackle and staying inbounds to score. He broke a Craig Newsome tackle and Reed, who's been the forgotten man, a 56-yard reception for his first touchdown of the season. In the action a lot, and Robert Smith catching screen passes, but uh, the big play tonight, Cunningham to Reed, it's 10 to three. Burgers kick, fielded a yard in by Roel Preston. A pass to 20. And Roel with a big run back, trying to stay in bounds, and Roel Preston scores for the second time in a career that's only four and a half games old. Third down and two. And that's caught by Carter, flag is thrown. What a great job by Palmer of sticking his face in there. I want some more money on Palmer if I'm going to do that. First down from the 48-yard line. Randall going deep again, adjusting his Moss, oh. and then oh. Randy Moss squeezes his way in for the touchdown. It is unbelievable. He just throws it up, and these guys ca catch the football. I, this is like a circus out here with these guys. Randy Moss is the best young receiver that I have seen maybe ever. Glasses as Rhodes go oh, his ears. That guy, I, you know, I always was nervous playing against him. From the 34, Favre throwing into a lot of traffic and That's picked, picked off. off. Intercepted by Orlando Thomas, and Thomas takes it all the way back to the 35. 43 yard line. And Cunningham's going to keep it. Whoa, and Randall whoa, loses whoa. the football. Does Holiday have that? Well, he's number 90, and he does. Either this or a 52-yard field goal. They're going to go for it, and they don't get it. Henderson. So after a nine-yard gain on first down, the Viking defense rises up 
Boach Fazio. <laughs> Five yard line. Randy Moss split wide to the left. Take the Smith. Going deep. Looking for Randy again. Perfect throw. Great catch. Darren Sharper with good coverage, but what can you do against a defense ranked number one in the league coming into the weekend? Cunningham to the end zone, and that's knocked down and nearly intercepted. And Newsom, realizing he could have had the pick, he stormed in the neighborhood. Ball is a 24. Screen. Smith gets a block. Picks up the first down. Heading for the end zone. Touchdown, Minnesota. Robert Smith is one of those underrated players in the NFL. For whatever reason, gets forgotten about. Pretty damn sure he had a couple seasons of around 13, 14, 1,500 yard seasons rushing the ball out of Ohio State. Robert Smith, unbelievable running back. I don't think he played for anybody else. Like we always do this when I do these damn videos. I'm sure everybody's kind of sick of it, top of my damn head, right? But I don't believe Robert Smith played for anybody else besides the Vikings. Could be wrong on that one. His impact, obviously, sure as hell wasn't like it was if he did play for anybody else when he was on the Minnesota Vikings. <laughs> they are plentiful. Third down and seven from the 47-yard line. Farr escapes, oh. but not a second time, and this time he is wrapped up by Derek Alexander. And he got away from John Randall. Oh, oh baby. Six. And here they come from the 50-yard line. Everybody coming. And Randall gets it away and finds a wide open Chris Carter. And a stutter step nets him a huge gain to the 15 yard line. Anderson attempts a 25 yard field goal. And that is his second of the night. A kickoff return by Preston. Offensively, they got a field goal. Here's an end around. This is Antonio Freeman inside the 30. On third down and two. Big play for Green Bay here. And it's far looking to throw, going to the end zone, and picked off because the ball floated. He had Freeman open, but the ball floated on him, and Robert Griffith with the pickoff. Destroys a corner's contest. Absolutely. Third down and eight. Do it again. Only a three-man rush, no pressure, and the pass is caught by Carter. Only three linemen in a down stance. And Randall's going to sling it down for Randy Moss, who makes the catch and takes it to the 10-yard line. Back into the game even after a field goal. So here's Anderson to make a 17-point lead, 20 points. Oh, terrific. Oh, no. Second down and 13. That's a $500 fine, Leslie. Far throwing deep, and it is Brooks trying to make the catch, and it is picked off. Intercepted by Griffith, the third Minnesota pick tonight. <laughs> Getting frazzled here. This is Randall Cunningham, and he's going for seven more, and it is Moss getting position, touchdown. He's oh, unstoppable. <laughs> Simultaneous possession goes to the offense. This is Randy. You have arrived. First and ten from the 11. And that's caught inside the five, and Davis takes it in for a touchdown. Three minutes and three seconds left in the game, and the Packers get their first offensive touchdown. It's almost staggering. Oh, it is. <laughs> I, 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 I don't doubt you. Onside kick attempt, and the Packers have recovered it at the 45. Touchdown passes. <laughs> And now Peterson going to the end zone, and he has another touchdown to Bill Schrader. The Vikings are 5-0. and They're the only un... Bill Schrader, man, he used to play for the Lions. I think Joey Harrington's first or second season did not produce the same numbers he put up when he was with Green Bay. Beaten team in the NFC, and they've come into Lambeau Field and handed Green Bay a defeat for the first time in Green Bay since September 3rd, 1995. 25 regular season. All right, there it is. Green Bay against the Minnesota Vikings. Cool stuff, man, from 1998. Good stuff. I think the uh, Denver Bron Broncos, excuse me, the Denver Dan Broncos were going to win the Super Bowl against the Atlanta Falcons. Jamal Anderson, the Dirty Bird, 
getting smashed by Denver in the Super Bowl for this season. But if you made it this far, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe. See ya.